Support Laneside. Get something cool. All right, guys, so welcome back. As always, I am the Bearded Beast, and uh, as you can see here, this this isn't a mirage. This isn't a cons well, well, actually, this is a conspiracy, because this is a new conspiracy from Radical, featuring well, this little guy down here, HK-22. Now, it is no secret that I really liked the original conspiracy, the black one. Not with HK-22, but just with the original cover stock. Now, the core dynamics in this ball have not changed, which I love, because I I did some really good bowling with the original. Uh, I won myself some, some good money. So uh, when I saw this, I got really excited, because we all know HK-22 makes everything better. So what am I expecting to see out of this? Well, because of that HK-22, I'm expecting this ball to be just slightly cleaner. Now, we know this ball is fairly smooth, the original was at least, so by giving this the HK-22, it's going to be a little cleaner through the front, so it's not going to bog down, which means it's going to have, potentially, a little bit more motion down lane. Now, I really like the motion of this one, uh, the original, so it's going to be interesting to see how much more hitting power we get out of it. Now, when it comes to layouts, we wanted to go with something that was really going to allow this ball to do what it was going to do, what it's designed to do. So we went with a 5-inch pin to pap. You can see right here. That's going to push the flare pattern. It's going to be max flare, but it's going to push it down lane a little bit farther, put a little bit more energy down lane, similar to the original one that I had, because I really liked that one. I, I can't say that enough, how much I like that one. We went with a 5.5-inch pin to mass bias right here. So we know that's going to make it fairly continuous. And we went with a 2-inch pin over line. So with a just under a 3 to 1 ratio, we know this ball is going to be fairly smooth, high revving, high flaring, and it's going to get through the pins pretty hard. Now for you dual angle guys, I didn't leave you out, and we can pretty much confirm this when we see 70 degrees, we're going to have some length out of it, 5 inch pin to pap, and a 55 degree valve. We know it's not going to, as soon as it sees friction, it's not going to jump left on us. Uh, we know it's going to see the mid lane, but it's going to be controllable. But rather than listening to me talk about it, why don't we take it lane side and see what this thing does. And we find ourselves down on the lanes with our resident two-hander, that'd be me, and we're joined by Scoops. Hey. And we're down on the high friction oil pattern. Now, uh, honest, ooh, honestly, if you look at this ball other than the logo, yeah. You can't tell them apart. No. I have the original new in box. I got this one. I was like, "What are they doing?" <laughs> but I know a, it looked. The, it looks the yeah. same. But there's a little bit more. Uh, a little bit more performance now. We're now, seeing. I'm gonna tell you something. Rob didn't really pull that shot. It just hooked. It just hooked. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, because uh, uh, I'm gonna move left really quickly off of yeah. this. I know that this hook, this ball hooks a lot. Yeah. We've seen the conspiracy asymmetric core before. You see, I'm going to project it a little difference. farther. Yeah. Um, we've seen this core before. I yeah. loved it. I yeah. said it in the opening. Um, I've won money with this ball. I love this yeah. ball. They added HK22, and what does that mean? Uh, it makes it better. That's because right. Everything's better with HK22. So the original was smooth. With It still had good motion for a solid yeah. down lane, but it was still fairly smooth. Uh, at HK22, I think we're seeing a little bit cleaner, but I think we're seeing more performance down lane as well. It, that's the thing is, it's it's so misleading the HK22 because you can see it gets through the front cleaner, but mm -hmm. doesn't change the way it reacts. It's still good right? down lane, yeah. yeah. Like you, you can see, I'm still nice. Wow. I'm in that uh, about six boards deeper yeah. than what, what my benchmark is on this shot. Yeah. Um, and you can see it's very clean down lane. You can see it spin up. When it comes off the spot, what I was worried about, with a big 021 core in it, I was really worried about it rolling out and just yeah. seeing the break point rolling forward. This thing just seems to keep hooking. Yeah, it, it, it gets there and it's stable, but it doesn't stop. Like That's it's Yeah, like... And for somebody that with drawing with two fingers, it's that's something that's a bonus. Yeah, because you're always worried. No, about no, no. It. The bonus comes later. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm gonna move yeah. another five boards here. I'm I'm now ten boards left okay. of where I started. Uh, I'm gonna be doing. I'm trying to project it as much as I can. 
you can see you can see oh, how wow. it slows down yeah. and it's not just jumping left no it's making a nice smooth arc motion around and then down to the pocket yeah and that's that's be a benefit of it being solid yes right because you're not going friction friction, friction. oh there's a friction Boom. right like, that's right it, it's got sees the friction and settles in. I was trying to show off some flair there, but yeah. it, it uh, didn't end up making it on the screen. The ball was flaring a good six to seven inches. Oh, yeah. Um, I didn't, I mean, I put on a strong layout on it, but I didn't put on a, re like a, a just hook off the lane. Yeah. I just put on a regular layout, and this ball just does not stop. Well, it's got the, the 500, 2000 skip sand on it, too, which yep. is really cool. Oh, oh. oh come on! You! Oh. Slap that baby out. That's right. Um, that that was from 50, by the way. Yeah. Uh, so that's 15 boards left of where I started. Um, obviously, that's not where I expect to play this. I expect no. this to be in and around the five to six board difference. And that's where I took this one. Yeah. And you can see how hard that ball hit. Yeah. Um, what do you think... Here we are with the Rattler. Every uh, company has a ball similar to this. Yeah. Uh, and this is my benchmark. What you saw me throw the original. You threw the original. Yeah. What do you think of the performance in comparison? Because you can see my rattler is yeah. nice and smooth. Yeah. I don't have to circle the lane with it. Yeah. It definitely, like I said, it just it just makes it better. The H game. <laughs> I I can't say it enough. It's just any negative thoughts I had about the conspiracy. Yep. Kind of go away because it just gets that that little bit cleanness to yep. the front and gets the the hold and then takes well, off. Well, right? yeah, because the last conspiracy we saw, the purple conspiracy yeah. scheme had a shine on it. And right yeah. off the bat, we said, take the shine off it. It's way better. Yeah. This doesn't have a shine. No. And look at the performance. Watch the slow-mo here. That's... Look wow. how... Look at the way it cornered. Yeah. And that's the that's what I said. It's it's just... it Somehow, with the HK, it gets through the front it's clean, but it yep. doesn't... It still starts hooking, like it's got the transaction that it, it makes, right? It makes it seems to make pearls faster response, but solids more controllable. Yeah, which is really weird. Yeah. Here we are with the lane level, the rattler versus the radical conspiracy, and uh, just watch. I oh, love geez. the way that that stood up. Yeah. Um, I was really worried with this ball because of that, like I said, with that core. Yeah. Even though I liked it one-handed, yeah. I was afraid two-handed it was going to be too much. too much. Yeah. And I was very, very happy with the fact that this ball, I mean, watch it come off the, off the front there. It doesn't roll forward. It's continuous. No. It, yeah. It very, just keeps very going. Very, very continuous. Yeah. yeah. So I think they hit a home run with this. HK22, how long till we get an HK22 Intel? all I want to know. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss a show. So until next time, guys, we'll see you lane side.